guys, what's up? So, what's up, what's up, what's up, everybody? So, let me just check it out that uh, we right now live. Let's see if the links part went on. Let me just uh, let everybody know that, hey, we are live. <clears throat> so, uh, I can see that I've already broadcasted the link. And, hey, hey, Bulkit, uh, so Bulkit is there with us. So, guys, uh, quickly, it's me, Gaurav, uh, you know, you already, most of you already know me, and people who don't know me, uh, you know, I'm, uh, I'll just quick, quickly give me, give a little bit, uh, you know, brief introduction about myself. So, hi from Brazil. Hey, hi, what's up? So, uh, guys, today I want to just quickly tell you about, you know, myself, and then we'll get into, you know, the chef together. Okay, so this is my first live periscope, and I am a digital marketing trainer. My name is Gaurav Madan, and I've been training professionals in the field of digital marketing from the past one and a half years. I've trained more than 1,000 professionals in the field of marketing and I've helped them to grow their business and I've helped them to achieve a lot more. Not just that, uh, I've been actively involved in various consulting assignments. So, hey uh, guys, good evening, Aditya. A very good evening to you. All right, so happy birthday. Thank you so much, Swapnil. Uh, you know, it's really a pleasure having you guys join me on my birthday today. All right, great to have you, everybody here. Okay, cool, cool. Happy birthday. All right, thank you so much, Aditya. So guys, that's, that's a little bit a quick introduction about me. Now I, I need to tell you, uh, I need to ask you guys, everybody, come on guys, I, I need, I'll just give, give you a quick intro about the, uh, about this Periscope, people who don't know about Periscope. So in Periscope, what you could possibly do is, uh, first thing is, you could actually go ahead and, uh, you know, type in the chat box if you want to chat with me, interact with me. Thank you so much, Harzad, for, for your warm, wish, warm wishes. Okay, so first thing is you could type and chat with me. That's the number one thing which you could do. Okay, you could... Put forward the thoughts which you're having in your mind across to me. That's one. Second thing, you could quickly, you know, whenever you feel that I've delivered value in an, any kind of, any way whatsoever, you could actually press on the screen to give me hearts, okay? So hearts are nothing but social currency. It, it's, it's not going to really be, you know, uh, something which I'm going to uh, getting benefit from out of it. It's just a way to appreciate on Periscope, all right? So that's another way. So guys, what is the purpose of this Periscope, all right? So you, you could quickly type in, you know, just try, uh, try, you know, tapping onto the screen multiple times and you'll see that you start seeing color, uh, hearts of multiple colors. Here we go. So you can see hearts of multiple colors are right now flowing in. Okay, so that's, that's a way to appreciate on Periscope. So I hope by now you've understood what Periscope is. All right, let's get into the scope now. Okay, so what is the, what is the best particular thing of this? I mean, what, what is the objective of the scope? Why am I doing the scope right now? So guys, the objective is to provide as much value as I could, all right? And the second thing which I, I want exactly is, I want to help you achieve more success, all right? In your business, in your life, wherever you're stuck with. Okay, I'm just 25 right now. I'm, I'm freaking out right now, trust me. I just turned 20, 25 today. And it's like, you know, man, I'm, I'm going mad today because I've already covered half of the journey of my life and I'm still... I'm still, uh, you know, not where I actually want you to want myself to be. So, guys, it's going to be really, really uh, amazing stuff. So, Rikin says, hi, Gaurav, seeing after you long time. Same here, Rikin. Nice, nice to, uh, nice, you know, you're joining me in here. All right, I really appreciate that. So, guys, now, uh, it's all about me helping you from whatever skill sets I have gained so far, okay, uh, and making it really big. So, Taylor says, are you really 25? Yes, ma'am, I'm really 25. I'm, I'm, I'm 25, okay, and I've, uh, I've achieved a lot of things already, but my uh, tally consists of a long list which I have to achieve. I, I actually want to speak at Harvard by the age of 30. That's what my objective is. That's what my, you know, goal is right now to, to go there. So that's why I'm doing a lot of stuff right now. So this is my mini office. So, okay, so if you can see right now, this is my mini office. This is a, there's a whiteboard here, and these are certain gifts which I got today. All right, so hi, hi Rahul, uh, hi from London. Hi guys, how are you doing? Uh, I really appreciate that you jumped on to my Periscope today. So guys, here it is. So now you could ask me the questions, okay? You have the chat box right there. You could go ahead, you could ask me the questions. So what is your job? Uh, I'm a digital marketing trainer, okay? And I train people in the field of digital marketing. And not just marketing, I'm also a professional consultant. I consult people to help them grow their businesses and scale it to a level where uh, they actually, you know, it, it seems really out of the, you know, achievable things. I really help them to achieve that level. So that's, that's what my job is right now. 
Okay, and and I want to actually help as many people as I can from all the skill sets I've actually learned, which are really rare in this field. And you know, so that's that's what I want to do. All right, so Barakuda, it says Barakuda. All right, in India, great. Yeah, I'm in India. That's what I do. But I actually do a lot of international marketing as well. And for through the help of Periscope, I believe I'll be able to break the boundaries, right? And I would be able to get right into the zoom of the entire world. Like I, I could help everybody. All right, so Aditya says that's at dsm.com. That's where I teach. Okay, so that's that's our institute, and we're really, really, uh, you know, helping a lot of people, a lot of entrepreneurs in India to grow their businesses, to helping people, students to actually get jobs, and a lot of stuff. Uh, okay, so number one thing, number one question. Here we go. Rajesh has number one question. Now, Rajesh says, how to search product as an affiliate? All right, so Rajesh depends upon what kind of category are you looking for. So if you're looking to promote a product into the uh, digital goods category then you could always go to clickbank when you click go to clickbank or or there is also jv zoo so guys i'll really, really appreciate if somebody somebody could write it in the chat box okay so if somebody could write it in the chat box clickbank and jv zoo all right jv zoo.com I, I would really appreciate that just bring that up in the, in the chat box so uh, what you could do is you could go back go to on onto these two particular websites you could register as an affiliate all right and then once you go there, you 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 know you could just get back and uh, you could search for the products, the ones which are going to be a highest selling products in your category in digital goods part. All right, so you could actually go for them and uh, you could actually grab it up, grab the link, you know, do a review, maybe uh, do a paid promotion on Facebook, maybe somewhere else, wherever you wish to do it, you could just go ahead and really crush it hard. All right, so that's that's uh, how you find in space, like products in digital space. And always try to look for EPCs, okay? EPCs is earning per click. So if the EPCs is higher, uh, you need to go back and you know you just you just need to get back, okay, grab that particular offer, and maybe do a YouTube video and write a review, do SEO, maybe promote it uh, through your email list or whatever possible options you have with you, okay? So guys, come on, ping, put in more questions if you have, all right? So uh, I'm going to quickly share. And, and do appreciate, do give me the hearts if you really, uh, you know, find value of our, whatever I'm telling you. So I would really, really uh, appreciate that. Just, you know, to treat. Okay, so hi, says Mikhail. Hi, Mikhail. Long time. Uh, you know, we haven't met. So I guess this is the first time Mikhail is coming around and uh, he'll be having a live conversation again. All right, great to have you here, Mikhail. So guys, quick, uh, you know, uh, quick in, uh, information about the day. So today, uh, it was my birthday and, you know, we, we, like last night, I'll just grab my phone and I'll show you. We really celebrated like crazy. So right now I'm doing a periscope out of my tab and at the same time I have my phone with me because it's the best video marketing tool. Video marketing tool. A video marketing tool is a video marketing platform is there. You have a uh, uh, you know uh, YouTube that's the best video marketing platform and Facebook. Anyways, as a quick info, uh, this is the picture of last night. You know uh, they, these guys actually rubbed the whole chocolate around my face. It was like really really crazy. Thank you so much for all the birthday wishes. Thank you so much, team, for wishing me uh, uh, my birthday. All right, so guys, come on, go ahead. Uh, ask me more questions. So video marketing tool is that, and if you're looking to make videos, so you could you have a uh, you know a lot of ways to make videos. You could go ahead to Fiverr.com and outsource. That's one. Second, you could just go ahead and you know uh, create things through Expandio, maybe Camtasia if you want to screen record it and stuff like that. And everything. All right. So thank you so much, Mikhail, and uh, you know, whosoever is wishing me birthday right now. Thank you so much, guys. So guys, this is more about you. This is not about me. Uh, it's it's more about you. I want to provide maximum value to you, uh, so that you know I could help you in your business. If you want to promote our website in UK, will what will be the difference for paid and SEO? So uh, there is no not much of a difference in terms of how you're going to promote it. All right, only thing is you just need to find out the psychology of UK people. If you want to promote a product, you need to find out uh, what kind of wordings they use, what kind of terminology they use. Okay, you need to really, really uh, dig into that detail. You need to research it out. And based on whatever their likings are, you know, you'll have tons of websites seeing, uh, getting you. Like just Google it or, or you know, go to Google. Uh, we have something called as Google Trends to see what are the trends going on. And then we have some certain, uh, you know, we have the Google AdWords Planner tool. You could see that and you could search for keywords and then, you know, you could come up with, write out those articles and then preferably when you're doing SEO, you go and, you know, you go onto those websites, which is uh, like, which is specific to UK. You go to UK at the base websites and do a lot of backlinking. Okay. So that's what is going to help you if you do a lot of backlinking at that point in time. That's, that's what it's going to do. 
uh, really help you. All right, so got off in call center mode for his accent. Not really, reckon. Uh, I'm not in the call center mode right now, but it's it's, it's just like uh, that's how that's how we roll, right? Let's just roll into it. Come on, guys, go ahead. And if you if you find the answer good, uh, you could appreciate me by giving hearts. Tap on the screen, you know, to continuously give me hearts if, if that's something which you wish to do. And uh, you know, you could get, give a maximum of 500 hearts. But it's not really about hearts; it's about providing more value. Okay, so guys, come on, go ahead, ask me more questions related to your business if you have any. Just give me a moment. I have some things ringing. Uh, so that I'll just quickly get my phone and see if everybody is able to join and hop on to my training. All right, so and PPC in UK will it be different? Uh, not really. PPC is also not different. Uh, uh, Kohli, uh, so I, I don't know exact names. So PPC is not at all different. You just need to you know check out those keywords which these guys are searching for according to your niche or industry, and just go ahead and you know make the ads according to whatever I have told you or whatever you know, and you can just go ahead and do it, uh, roll it. All right. What was the video outsourcing company? So Fiverr.com, F-I-V-E-R-R.com. All right, so Fiverr. So that's Fiverr. You could also go to Upwork.com, which is uh, previously known as Odes, and you could outsource this there. Okay, so Vista.com. I'm not really sure about Adi. Adi. So Adi, could you please type in Fiverr.com, F-I-V-E-R-R.com? If somebody could type that, uh, you know that would be real. I really appreciate that. All right, so. Go ahead, go ahead, come on, uh, bump in the questions. So, so right now, you know, the, the periscope is more like generic periscope and we are doing just questions right now, okay? But what, we are, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, quickly jot down topics from the next periscope and I'm going to have specific training uh, according to that, okay? So uh, so now, uh, that's that's one. Another thing is, you could actually, you're, you're also going to have recordings for this particular web, uh, particular periscope. I'm going to definitely, you know, put get them recorded because this is like usually available for only one hour, uh, one, 24 hours, okay, and I'm going to do that and I'm going to put it right there, uh, you know, specifically onto my website for you to watch later, okay. So that's such way I'll be able to add more value for people who are not really able to hook onto the uh, Periscope late night, they would be able to join me uh, as well and, you know, get the value which they actually want. All right, so guys, go ahead and, you know, ask me more questions. So in case if I'm skipping your questions because of, you know, that there would be uh, questions coming over, in case I skip that, so you could always go ahead and, you know, write it again so that I could go ahead and answer your question. All right, so I missed one of the questions, I believe. So I would really appreciate if you could just write it down again. All right, so guys, go ahead and ask me questions. In the meantime, I'll show you, like, really quickly, uh, you know, a really cool stuff which I got yesterday. So this is a gift I got yesterday. And it's a custom made gift. If you could see, it's written God of Madan uh, and it's a pen stand. Uh, okay, and it, it, it has my engraving right here. It's a pretty cool gift, which I got from one of my friends. It says speaker, marketer, and entrepreneur. Again, okay, it says uh, godofmadan.com. Okay, so that's that's what it is. So, uh, Shita says, what exactly is your new course about? So, Shita, my new course is all about consulting and basic knowledge of the internet. So, the uh, target is really to reach out to people who, who are really stuck with their day-to-day -day jobs, they are really craving it out and they really, you know, uh, want to just get out of that and so so I want to help them to give them a skill set which is pretty basic in terms of building websites but then when it comes to consulting which is the second part of the course, okay, that's where the exciting things happen wherein I show how you would be able to generate leads from the local market or from the internet and actually convert them to get them to pay for that, all right. Shirt was very nice. Thank you so much, Hadi. How to search keywords? Any good website for to promote product? It's extremely simple. Go to Google AdWords Keyword Planner tool. Okay, just type Google AdWords Keyword Planner tool, and when you once you go there, you could actually uh, uh, find out the the related keywords to whatever product you want to actually uh, you know promote. So that's something which you could do. It's easy. That's not a big deal. Okay, please explain your strategy of digital marketing. Menka says. So Menka, my strategy, as I've always said. Uh, I'm not in there for money. I'm, I'm in there for leverage. Okay, that's what I, I always have enjoyed. And the client is more uh, important than the destination. Okay, so what I'm trying to do in terms of digital marketing, I'm trying to connect to new people as much people as much uh, as many people I could connect with and provide them value, and then gain equity. And maybe I could use that equity later. Maybe write a book. I don't know. I don't have any plans uh, as such for now. But I could write a book, and uh, you know, I could cash on that, I could sell a t-shirt of my community, my niche, and I could do a lot of things, you know, if I, I have equity. So my basic requirement is to, to, you know, give, 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 provide you a lot of value, 
and when I give you a lot of value, I, I, I want the people be in the guilt of actually buying it from me because I've provided them so much value. So that's 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 the entire ball game. If people trust me, if, if people trust you for that matter, okay, in any industry you are in, people are going to definitely buy from you. Okay, they're not going to buy from the biggest giants like Flipkart, the Amazons, and whatever it is. Okay, but it's going to be completely from your end. So that's that's particular the, 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 this particular part. Okay, so uh, I guess internet is a little bit, it's getting disconnected most of the time. So uh, possible, the, the uh, right right now streaming is absolutely perfect from my side. Uh, maybe there may be lags at certain other part. Email marketing knowledge, okay, so email marketing knowledge somebody wants. So what kind of email marketing knowledge uh, you know you want? So come on guys, uh, go ahead, ask me what kind of email marketing. Go a little more specific. You want, uh, you know, autoresponders, email knowledge, or what do you want exactly? Okay. So in depth, so I cannot really provide you email marketing knowledge in depth right now, okay? But what I could do is I could suggest you a course which you should take in case you are really want to, you know, nudge it hard. I'm going to suggest you two things, okay? Right now, two things. One thing is called autoresponder madness. Guys, come on, go ahead, all right? So if somebody could write it down, something called as autoresponder madness. Madness. Okay, that's by Andre Chappell. You can find it in cat.cr. Okay, cat.cr. So you could just go to kat.cr and uh, you know that's that's a website which will which will be able to help you to get to like autoresponder madness. That's one. Second course which I would definitely recommend you is from Anthony Morrison. He is one of the most renowned email marketers in the world. He has been featured on CNBC. Okay, that's another one which I would definitely recommend you. I don't know what what is the name of the course, but search for Anthony Morrison. It's called Email Domination, I believe. I, I believe it's called Email Domination. Okay, that's by Anthony Morrison. So that's that's the that's the thing. One is autoresponder madness. You you must take that. It's it's a free course. Okay, and then you go for email domination. That's another course which I would highly recommend you if you want to really go into the deep down roots of email marketing. And some of the people were saying email marketing from real estate, email marketing for uh, India. So I could just, you know, uh, tell you right now what exactly you need to do. Guys, it's, it's all about the ball game. It's all about your list. The money lies in the list, okay? So if you could build a list, if you could build a list, that's the most important way of getting traffic. Okay, the major part is to build a list. If you could build a list, that's the best part. How to build a list? There are various ways to build a list. You know, provide something valuable to the person, okay? In, in the, that particular sector, like if it is real estate, you know, provide something very, very valuable. It's like, like, you know, seven investments mistake every every uh, property investor makes, okay? So pro make an ebook on this and put it up on a, on a pop-up maybe or put it on a landing page, on a sidebar of your website, okay? And then when the people are going to come to your website, they're going to go and check out that ebook and take the emails, okay? So give them value and then... As, an, as you move forward, you're going to build your list stronger and stronger and stronger, okay? And ultimately, that is going to what lead you. And, and that, then you possibly, you know, once you have this, you know, develop a repo and reputation and relationship with that particular person, okay, whomsoever is subscribing to your list, so what you could possibly do is you could go ahead and then shoot them promotional emailers, okay, which they may be interested in. Okay, so one person has asked how to create an ebook. It's extremely simple. Uh, you could outsource it to Fiverr.com again for $5. It's like 30, 300 uh, rupees, I believe, in Indian currency or $5 in US currency. So you could outsource it or, or, or if you don't want to outsource it, you could go to leadcapturemastery.smartmember.com to know how to create one. Okay, So you could go to leadcapturemastery.smartmember.com uh, to create one. So guys, I would really appreciate if you could just type this resource in the chat box, leadcapturemastery.smartmember.com. So that's a course by uh, Katie Lendon. It's a free course. You could just register and, you know, just quickly go into that, grab, grab a look how to create an ebook and just do that particular part. Thank you so much, Shritish, for that. So that's, that's Lead Capture Mastery. I believe that is going to really help you. What up? So it's, it's great. Brad here. So what's up at your end, buddy? Okay, so leadcapturemastery.smartmember.com. Great. So, uh, go ahead guys, uh, you know, ask me more questions. I'm, I'm waiting for your questions. Alright, so how to build a brand without within a niche, example, premium jewelry. Okay, so, Pulkin, hello from Tampa, Florida. Hello, uh, Brad, what's up? So, uh, so, how to build a 
niche and premium uh, jewelry sector. So that's the question, right? So it's extremely simple. Okay, uh, it's extremely simple. Uh, what you need to do is again provide value. Look to provide value in the premium jewelry industry. If you don't want, to, you know, if you don't want to provide value in that segment, like because the goods are physical goods, you cannot really create value by providing free free premium jewelry. That that does not make sense. So what you need to see is you need to look another into another marketing angle. Okay, you need to look look into another marketing angle. So what is the marketing angle I'm talking about? Say. Your, your target audience premium jewelry your target audience is women ladies girls right whatever your target audience is look for other valuable things they may be looking into like for example see i'll just give you an example uh, all right so a lot of people a lot of women are interested in fashion and they want to learn fashion they are, they are interested in cooking they want to learn cooking okay so you you maybe you, you can create a course on cooking a little course on cooking or maybe you know uh, get a video and get you know get more and more uh, people from that particular niche of that particular demo to subscribe to your list for to become a member and once they become a member then from your particular you know uh, your uh, i mean that's the same brand you could say hey, i've got another brand into premium jewelry and then try to you know start creating repo from there and you would really have great stuff other than that what you could possibly do is if you don't want to do that again so there there, there could be another way Okay, premium jewelry in, in includes a lot of uh, you know I would say things related to appearance. Okay, so if you could hack more things related to appearance, okay, if you could hack more things related to appearance and actually provide value in that particular field, which could be a digital product like or a digital good, giving them for free, that's going to really really help. Okay, and maybe uh, even if you don't want to do that, it's it's you. Ads are always there. Okay, advertisements are always there. You could always leverage the advertisements. Uh, you know, most of uh, the DSIM part, they they were never uh, really dependent on SEO. They built a brand completely on the basis of advertisements. And advertisements online is pretty cheap, I believe. Okay, so that's another one. So happy birthday, sir, current DSIM student. Uh, thank you so much, uh, current. All right. So how to find target audiences? Market uh, audiences US, UK for digital products. Okay, so digital products. Okay, so now digital products. It's something interesting. Digital products is uh, you know it's, it's pretty simple. Just go to uh, check it out. You know whoever would be interested in digital products. What are the kind of niches you have in digital products? Okay, most the best the best tip I can give you right now is something called as solo ads. Okay, solo ads. I have never said or never told this particular strategy for US or UK. To anybody, thank you so much for wishing me a happy birthday. All right, Prax. So, uh, what is the strategy? What is called solo ads? Okay, now solo ads is an interesting concept altogether. Solo ads is if you go to international market, like you know, there are platforms which will actually go ahead. I mean, you know, platforms are there where there are people having big list. They are having big email list in particular sectors, okay, or particular segments or industries, but they don't know. How to monetize that particular email list? Okay, for that reason, what happens? They do solo ads, meaning that you create something like a freebie, or you create a particular product, and then reach out to those people who have big email list. There are platforms which which are there. I'll tell you. Maybe I uh, I could tell you. Uh, right now, I don't remember those platforms, but there are platforms where you could go ahead there, and then you could approach them, and you could say, Hey, we will pay you one dollar. Per click, or maybe we will pay you 0.5 dollars per click, and just assuming that your your product is say 19.9 dollars, okay, 19.9 dollars, then what you could possibly do is you could go ahead and uh, you know take that targeted list and send it to your landing page, to your sales page, and trust me, that really converts awesomely well. It's really going to uh, really going to be a profitable stuff, specifically with solo ads because they are actually very very targeted lists. Okay, so that's one way. I would highly recommend you to go there and do that. Other than that, you could always go to Facebook and leverage that. You know, target the same demo and uh, do other parts, right? So that's something which you could do. All right, so best SEO strategy for a local website to compete ranking with local search engines like Just Time. Easy, extremely easy. Okay, make go ahead and go to every each and every local directory. Put your website in the right there. Okay. Get your website covers in the local newspapers and all online PR directories as well. Okay, it, it, it's all about the you know visibility. If you're going to spread it everywhere on the internet, in like in forums, in PR directories, in, in like you know Quora, everything which is you know 
geo based if you go to spread your website right there everywhere you you're definitely going to you know make a big mark even you can print just just that i i have happened to beat wikipedia for once like for one of my websites okay happened to beat wikipedia nobody can crush that okay so that's such possible if you go ahead and you know just go on and uh, go on go on go on go on and keep increasing your visibility by maybe going to various kind of places wherever you could find where wherever uh, in, maybe you could do guest blogging in the particular niche in your in your particular geographic location or or whatever you feel like and, and obviously the keywords that's the number one part uh, you already know about keywords i guess that's the most basic use local keywords get into google listings okay do a lot of advertisements as well use display ads which are cheap okay uh, it will get help you get traffic and the initial boost and then you could actually crush it really big so it's all depend depends on you know how much important like how much traffic you are having and how much visibility you are having create a mixture of free and paid and win it okay you will crush it you will really crush it all right so go ahead guys i i'm, I'm sorry excuse me sorry if i missed some questions in between maybe you could just retag those questions i would really appreciate that and guys if you like the answers you could always give hearts to appreciate me okay so that i understand you you found value okay you found value all right go ahead ask me questions so shitesh was asking about a list i guess a list of resources shitesh i don't have as such a list of resources because uh, digital marketing is really really deep and it has taken me almost uh, uh, almost like you know 5 years to really learn everything and it's scattered really scattered maybe i i'll some sometimes sit down and make a list but that's not on my priority okay so another question was there how to get the traffic like how to get traffic what is the first step traffic you know it's it's easy uh, how you could get it from so many different ways seo search engine marketing do advertisement facebook ad paid promotion okay then go into uh, i mean not just facebook go into twitter go into linkedin do a lot of guest blogging okay uh, go into pr directories get and your get yourself covered into big websites like your story uh, maybe kickstart sorry uh, sorry uh, not kickstarter kickstarter is a different website your story next big word road in words those are those are the communities you need to hack in india if you're looking for outside you need to find out websites like mashable uh, okay uh, you need to approach these guys big guys the next web and you need to really ask them to cover you give them a story okay get get yourself covered uh, get yourself covered that's the basic objective okay if you want to get free traffic free organic traffic find out big hacks then also provide value and then you know use ads like again make something valuable for the your niche and get into the ads ads are extremely cheap guys you need to understand that if you were to advertise on tv okay that would have been a completely different ball game and here we are actually advertising on digital media which is so so cheap i cannot tell you you know if you see this piece of crap here this is a piece of crap for me this is not a crap actually this is a showcase in my room and it's been like ages I I don't even remember that when was the last time I actually switched on my TV. So, but still they're so so fucking big, you know, expensive. But if you go talk about digital media, that's the best way, you know, just crush it, invest some money, and and get the traffic going. Okay, so that's what I would do instead of waiting and sitting back, and instead of you know just things would happen automatically. Let like, let's depend on SEO or something like that. I would not really do that. I would actually dive into the paid ads right away and get people to my website. Test it out. All right. So it's extremely, extremely important. Don't just sit back for the magic to happen. You have to make it happen. Okay, if you don't take the step, it is not going to happen. So that's the number first thing. Go out, experiment, you know, with ads and get the traffic. So which ads? If your business is a need-based business, go for Google advertisements. That's going to convert really heavy for you. If it is a want-based business, go for Facebook, something like a discovery platform or Twitter or LinkedIn, maybe. Okay, and then just hack it up. So that's something which you should do. Also, you could go for Google Display Network. All right, so guys, uh, go ahead, go ahead, come on, ask me more questions. So uh, I'm up for it. Any business problem if you have, even I would be uh, love to spend time with you, and I would love to answer that as well. Shit. All right. So we're back. Yeah. So how much? minimum investment for paid advertisement on facebook and promote website not much you could get a, a you know website clicks for as little as 3 rupees per click okay so if you could send like maybe a uh, 100 visitors to your website potential visitors potential traffic potential you know customers you got you got your point 
it's just you know try to send like test it out with 300 rupees maybe 500 rupees and if you don't see results change your strategy see your funnels and that would work all right so Nira says happy birthday thank you so much Nira for joining me and thank you so much for your blessings so uh, I guess that's that's the minimum investment you need I guess anybody would have like 500 bucks or 300 bucks to actually go on and hack into Facebook that's like number one traffic source right now but it's cheap right all right so guys uh, go ahead go ahead uh, I would love to hear your questions anything whatever you have go ahead shoot all right is affiliate marketing effective in India definitely shit it <laughs> affiliate is you know amazing it's, it's like an amazing concept so uh, earlier when it used to be there like I used to be like really against affiliate but Kunal always used to you know Kunal is the mentor I have in DSI he is the senior most guy in affiliate marketing with us but he always used to say God of affiliate works great in India as well and when I tried I, I could actually see you know it, it is actually phenomenal <laughs> if, if you're smart enough uh, you could hack it up like you know literally fast and you could make your way to 1 lakh rupees per month in no time maybe 2 lakh, 3 lakh, 10 lakh so Kunal does like 6, 7 lakhs per, per month with spending like one, one, 1 hour of his time I'm doing right now quite a lot of money in affiliate marketing with my uh, you know partner, business partner Saurabh so we do like per emailer we are, we are able to generate like 50,000 bucks 1 lakh bucks sometimes it, it just depends Okay, uh, what about WooCommerce plugin for affiliate marketing? So, uh, Minka WooCommerce uh, works good. I believe, you know, I've seen examples where people have built websites completely based on Amazon products. They've taken Amazon products and they've put them into their websites and then they've linked them directly to Amazon links instead of uh, actually putting, a, you know, a payment gateway right into their website. So, basically, whatever they, what, are, what are they doing? They're taking a product niche from a niche whichever you're interested in they're going into Flipkart or Amazon or wherever Amazon is the major uh, you know thing which because it's global it's big so they go there and uh, you know once they go in there, there what they do is they actually take all the product pictures and they write the descriptions and they make a complete e-commerce type looking website and when you click on the product which is buy now the button you're actually redirected to Amazon website or Flipkart website and you know that's, that's like a cool strategy uh, recently, you know, in a one batch, we actually even did this for Chacha Choudhury, Chacha Choudhury comics. Okay, and it, it worked for me. It was like, you know, I just did a little plain SEO on that, and I'm getting traffic on Chacha Choudhury comics page of my website. Nobody knows that even exi it even exists, but that's really cool. You can always hack it up. You know, that's a smart way. All right, so Karan was in the best grade. Uh, so guys, come on, go ahead. More questions. I hope Aminka this adds value. If it adds value, you could give me uh, the hearts. My major question is why will people come on my mini website for purchasing? Minka, people search, right? And when they search, they land up. So uh, it's not always that ultimately uh, you have to reach out to them. I, when they are going to be searching for you, they could also land up with, on your website. That's one. You know, you have to do all the possible methods and promote your website. For example, right now, I don't know if you know guys, you, most of you already know, let me just show it to you. I'm also building one website right now into the weight loss segment. Okay, and uh, weight loss segment, I'm, I'm building it on, on on Instagram. So I'm I'm building right now on Instagram right now. This is my handle, uh, and I'm I'm having pretty good success. Look at this. So this is like Instagram. I'm sending traffic from Instagram right now. Okay. So basically, you have to find out uh, ways to actually send traffic from different uh, places. Okay. If you could find out ways to send traffic, there's nothing nothing can beat that. Nothing can actually beat that. So, uh, you know, just find out good ways to send traffic to that website and build a community in that niche. Maybe Facebook groups, maybe a forum, okay, uh, maybe your Instagram handle, maybe maybe a LinkedIn group if it is a B2B product. So, whatever that kind of product is, just go ahead and build a community and provide value and send them, send them right to their products. So, that's the strategy. How much uh, money does Kunal spend on affiliate marketing every month? So, that's something which Kunal would be able to answer and I would not be. Okay, uh, that's not not really my job. Okay, can we make mini website on Instagram? That's possible. Uh, Milka, you could also make a website on Instagram, but that's not recommended. Build a community. The point is, Milka, you need to understand. First thing is, you need to give in order to get back. All right. So if you're only going to get, you know, think from a psychology that hey man, I want to get back. I want to just earn profit. Just earn profit. That's not going to happen. There's no magic happening here. Always you need to provide from value value 
first provide value, build a community, and once you build a community, redirect that traffic to whatever you want to redirect it to. Maybe your own business offers, or maybe somebody else's business offers. Whatever you feel like, you could actually redirect them there through whatever means you like. Okay, <clears throat> either an affiliate offer, maybe, or your own website. So that's do it. All right, so guys, I missed out a couple of questions. Maybe uh, uh, you could just type them again. I would really appreciate that. So we're only going to be doing more of 15 minutes, not more than that. What is the best payment gateway for a known e-commerce startup? Pay you money works best. Ashish, go for pay you money. All right, is there a group from forum where for people in Periscope can interact? Uh, I, I, no, I, I don't really know right now. Periscope is extremely new, and I don't really think so that there's going to be any forum right now where people from Periscope can interact. But like maybe you could pitch this idea to Periscope. All right, how uh, and where can I pitch a real estate customer? I want home seeker investor people on both. Uh, okay, so you want to pitch a real estate, real estate investor. Interesting. You know, I'm working on one of the real estate projects right now. Uh, right now, real estate website, this is, you know, in India specifically, real estate is really, really down. Investors are actually, prop, you know, investors are actually, builders rather, are actually commit, trying to commit suicide right now. This is an insider info which I'm telling you, which I recently got from my client because he was so stressed up with his property that it is just it isn't, it isn't selling. The sentiments are down, okay, in real estate right now. Uh, but if you want to actually go ahead and find out, so more customers, you need to reach out to them right now. That's the only way out. Reach out to them. Again, okay, reaching out to them, it's very simple. Use advertisements to reach out to them. Uh, do property listings. Go ahead and do property listings on all these places. You you have a lot of websites where you could do property listings. Specifically, housing.com is there. Then Magic Pix is there. It, it works. It really works. And if you know the art of pop-up marketing, I don't know, guys. Not a lot of people know about pop-up marketing. So I know about pop-up marketing. What I do is I, I act smart. And I, I actually prop up my property in a desired location onto on top of Magic Bricks, on top of something like uh, you know uh, housing.com. So that's doable. That's doable. If you have that kind of knowledge, you could do that as well. It's a really, really top class strategy. Okay, if I want to build a community for a niche, where do I start? Especially if this is India centric. So Shitesh, you need to build maybe you know uh, maybe build a membership website, maybe build a forum, okay, uh, and maybe start a Start up on show like this right now. I'm doing okay. I'm also building a community of great business people right now in India or rather across the globe. So just start a show, maybe okay, or maybe start a podcast and start reaching out to people with that podcast, and that would be your best go to waste go to strategy. Okay, uh, what if my FB account has been disabled? Can I create another account? Absolutely, you can. Okay, you must have done something wrong. Uh, so there are a lot of things which are restricted on FB now. So that's that's something which you should do. Courses you suggest for this? So there's no course. Should they start doing it? Okay, there's there's you know, depends on your niche. What is your niche? All right. So I don't know. Can you please explain? I've paid Magic Mix and and an acre, but there are many people. So uh, there are many people definitely. Okay, but at the same time, uh, it's not just that there are many people. Uh, they they are going to provide value to you if you're going to ultimately you know reach out to them and maybe provide take a little higher package or something. Okay. Go get to the brokers now. You know, guys, I'm going to share something very classy with you. So recently, in a, in a particular, uh, you know, real estate consulting assignment, what happened? So uh, um, one of my clients is really stressed out. So I suggested him one single thing. I said, Hey, man, you know, let's do one thing. We know our exact target audience, and we know the exact area where we want to sell. Let's go and let's go for flyers. Okay, let's make flyers, which is lo like very long flyers. Okay, like. Uh, a Size of a newspaper, okay. That's that's the kind of flyer, both side flyer. Go to a creative agency or go to a Photoshop designer, get your flyer made, and then go early in the morning at 3 a.m. or 4 a.m. in the morning to the newspaper circulation part where the actual circulation happens. Okay, it is going to be one center from where all the newspapers are segmented early in the morning, 3 a.m., 4 a.m. Okay, go to that particular area, get to that particular person, and give him some money. So, you know, just push that those particular pamphlets or those particular flyers right inside your newspaper. And trust me, you're going to get so many queries within no time. Okay, so that's another good way to hack it up. If you you cannot afford offline print right now, but if you know still know your or target audience, you could just go ahead with this method. So one of the questions was that can you please suggest a landing page, good landing page website? So now now I build all my landing pages on Optimize Press because I like it that way. Other than that, what you could go ahead is you could.